since the dawn of civilization. Mankind has tried to figure out what is the Red List. Oh, stop it! Stop it! Stop! Through the use of modern technology. No way! No! We can go back in time and find out where it all began. Ancient Aliens, The Red List. Well, something boys, and welcome to Zway to Glory, episode number 31, our Foot Champs and Division Rivals Rewards. Uh, I'm thinking maybe going forward we smash these two things into one video, combining both our Rivals and our Foot Champs Rewards. If you guys like the sound of that, if you guys like the sound of that for this series, drop a like on the video. Let's try and get back to 3,000 likes per epi on Zway to Glory. I'm thinking that's the new structure where we do uh, the recap video earlier in the week right after Foot Champs, then we do our Rivals Foot Champs Rewards every Thursday. Uh, both in the same epi and then maybe a foot draft Friday or a foot draft weekend on either Saturday or Sunday where we go over what's going on in the uh, in the series. So if you guys do like that idea for the new format, like I said, drop a like on the video. If you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button down below. Now, before we go any further, you guys are probably wondering yourselves, wait, what are you wearing right now? And it is a limited edition Real Madrid kit that was sent here to the Cuttleton FC offices. I've got three more, a limited edition Bayern, a limited edition Juve, and then a limited edition Manchester United kit uh, that EA and Adidas were kind enough to send me. So if you go over to my Twitter, you guys will be able to see those four kits in their full form. Uh, you're gonna be able to get them in, in game if you're fans of the club digitally, and then you can also buy them in stores. Again, not not an ad, uh, but you can also buy them in stores and at the, at the, at the Adidas store on the Adidas website if you guys uh, want to go get those but uh, this might be my favorite one it looks like a galaxy lock screen the Juve one's actually my favorite one but I actually can't wear it while I do a green screen because there's so much green in it um, so we were not able to put it on but here we are boys Cuttleton FC we managed to finish goal two last weekend uh, was the last weekend before the new patch dropped I, I I'll give my thoughts on the on the patch at the end of the epi um, I, I, there's some things I like and then some things I don't like. But as we do, per usual in every epi, uh, we are going to get to the board of directors comments. Leo Aguiar says, bro, was that a failed crip walk attempt? I bring the luck to my pack stance and could not try now. Oh, stop it! Stop it! Are you suggesting that my crip walk was a fail? Because I think I actually bossed out. Eric Corcoran says, Zway, as director of club conspiracies, I confirmed that EA representatives told me that you are currently on the red list while I was attending a Croatian yacht party. He told me that you'll be on the red list until further notice, but since you were recently added, it can be a week-to-week -week basis. You took Nep's spot. EA didn't like that. He changed recording rooms. Once you move to a new apartment, you will be removed from the red list. No! We're moving, okay, so I am moving to a new place in the next month or so. Um, and uh, am I gonna be taken off the red list? By the way, the red list is not real. I think EA, EA hate whenever we bring up the red list because it's like this little conspiracy. So for those of you guys that don't know, uh, my pack luck has been really good. Net's pack luck has been really good. A few other guys' pack luck has been really good. And people came up with this conspiracy theory that uh, there's this EA red list where, uh, and I think we talked about it last week, where the pack luck is so outrageous. I mean, in our division rivals and foot chance rewards, we packed 91... Ramos, 90 Lewandowski, and then uh, 86 Varane as a tradable card. So I can see where people are coming from, but it absolutely positively does not exist. The red list is not real. It's fun. It's like a fun little like uh, it's like a fun little inside joke for FIFA 19, uh, but it absolutely does not exist. I, if it did exist, I would love to be on it. But uh, Vasco Lopez says Zway put Courtois instead of Ter Stegen and Götze for Tony Kroos. Uh, you guys are going to see how the squad is looking. It's probably my favorite squad that I've had so far. We've included a French inform from La Liga who has changed the entire dynamic of the game. Um, Timo Werner, 85, not the 86, has changed the entire dynamic of the game. As a matter of fact, I think we can afford the 86, so that is one thing that we might consider doing, but you guys will be helping me with the construction of the squad going forward. But uh, like I said, boys, here we are in the account. We've got an hour and 30 minutes to complete the, the marquee matchups. Uh, this one is already completed, and then Porto... Uh, the Schalke, I don't believe was too difficult to do. We already had, uh, Geese, FC Porto, or Schalke player, so we get a rare mixed players pack for that, so we get a cheeky pack. Most of these guys are untradeable, so we're gonna go ahead and submit that into the club. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and submit that, which completes our UEFA Champions League marquee matchup. Speaking of Champions League, what's wrong with Liverpool? Is Mbappe the fastest player in the world, and... Why is Pep Guardiola not on Dancing on the Stars? Now, what do we do first? I feel like we gotta do the Div Rivals rewards first. Let's go ahead and do the Div Rivals rewards first. 
Uh, we are going to, per usual, uh, we managed to finish rank two, which is what we finished last week, which is what we got Varan in. Oh, sorry, in foot champs, we got Varan. But in these in these option three rewards, we got 90 Lewandowski and 91 Sergio Ramos. So uh, we are going to go ahead and confirm that. We're going to go take that. I'm going to make sure I write it down so we pop the right packs open. Uh, rank two, division four. We're getting closer to division three, but we get ourselves, what, two mega packs. Don't ask me why, but I've got this feeling like we're about to absolutely get something incredible. 58,000 coins is what we have on the account. Like I said, uh, oh, we have to do the recap. We have to do the montage. Hey, Pards, cue up that Weekend League montage, bro. Some Yang things happen. Yo, it's uh... one of your mods just ban me for saying way trash. It was only jokes. Please unban. Yeah, no, you're staying banned. If you say I'm trash, you're staying banned. Bobby want Tubby, you're staying banned. And I'm gonna use your two dollars at Taco Bell. I like it! You came into my life and you said that my FIFA plane was late. Why would you do that, Dad? Why the hell would you, why would you do that? And I don't know what I'm gonna get when I go to Taco Bell. I might get a number 11, which is the Tacos Loco Supreme. show you the transfer list. Uh, Griezmann, Ter Stegen, by the way, that comment that said replace Ter Stegen with Courtois, we might have actually done that. Uh, at the peak of the, at, at the height of the 83 players going for uh, a lot of coins, I managed to sell off uh, my Savage, my Laporte, Viviano, Nacho Fernandez, Bender, and Goetze. Uh, unfortunately, didn't make too many incredible uh, in investments. 89 Griezmann, probably won't use him for the rest of FIFA. There's just something about his card. I don't know if it's the fact that he doesn't have a weak foot, uh, but he just was not great for me. So I uh, replaced him with Ben Yedder. Uh, you guys probably would have seen that in the montage, but we do have um, we do have ourselves some rewards. So we're going to pop open our Jumbo Premium Gold Packs first. See if we get anything in here. Again, out of six packs, if we could get two walkouts... That's what I'm aiming for this week. Out of six packs, if we get two walkouts, that would be incredible. We get ourselves, hey, Socrates, 84? That is not a bad little pull right there. Untradeable, obviously, but uh, again, it's probably the most used line in, in FIFA YouTube. Can be used to do SBCs. Rongier, Timor, Kojiak. Again, these aren't the best packs, obviously. Uh, Jumbo Premium Gold Pack number two. And there was a time where I think we knocked out. Ah, it's not going to happen there. Can we get another board, though? Give me another board, EA. Yes, back-to-back -back boards in the Jumbo Premium and Gold Pack. Brazilian, Yardell, mm. Felipe. Why, I always confuse Felipe and Yardell. 83 Felipe, so again, not bad. 84 and 83. Again, when it comes to untradeables in those two packs, not great, not great packs by any means. You gotta look at the positives, and that is the fact that there's an 83 rated and 82 rated, uh, and then at the end of the pack, we get ourselves a Bebu. So where's our two mega packs? I don't know, boys. Is, is this the week where the pack luck finally reverts? Is this the week where uh, that guy is right? Maybe. Maybe, but I feel like an inform is in her. I feel like a really sick inform is in her future. Belgian, center mid. Hey, wait, Nangolan, 85 Nangolan, let's go. Hey, that is a startable player if we want to go with maybe an informy party. At the very least, yo, Nangolan, let's get a round of applause. I didn't even, I'm so used to that card most likely being a walkout. But we get ourselves a 85 rated Raja Nine Golan. Inter Nine Golan. Now hold on. By the way, RIP. Inter, I believe they lost yesterday versus Spurs. If he was tradable, 
what would he be going for? And I'm hoping he's not the best player. That's a 60,000 coin player. I, I wouldn't expect, I mean, our two best packs are still, are still yet to come. And I'm thinking we get a walkout in at least one of them. And we don't get anything in the form here. It is going to be Florenzi. Hey, 82 Florenzi. He goes, I believe, for about 5 or 6k if he was tradable. So, uh, Syria OP. There's just something about my account in Syria players that EA like, uh, that EA like trading me to. So, we get ourselves a cheeky Florenzi who we have, who do we have, what do we have on the right side? We have Liga Santander now. Okay. So, the other guy that I'm thinking about wiggling in the squad is, uh, that Lala. This is where we are hoping to get the walkout, boys. Come on, EA. It's not going to happen in the first one. Oh, man. Our, I feel like maybe it's our Red Wards that are going to boss out. Uh, ba -ba -ba, Portugal, center back, sa A, 84, 85 Pepe. Okay, so 285 players in our in our rivals rewards. Not bad. So 85 Nangolan and then 85 Hair Pepe, which, uh, again, I won't complain about. A uh, nice little pull right there. Is there anyone else behind him? 85 and then 82 Pao Lopez, Lanzini, Vernbloom, Quintero, and then Rooney the Roos. One rare players pack left to open. Rivals rewards. Ah, Rivals Rewards weren't great. I think maybe this is, he was right. Maybe we got taken off the red list. But anyway, Nangolan, Nangolan, and Kaleon. Nangolan, Florenzi, and then a two, hey, 285 rated players, right? So 285s will help us complete like an 85 or 86 rated SBC if, if, if we were so inclined uh, to pop one open. Uh, Kaleon, Felipe, Bartra, Toko, Ekami, and then Jesus, look at this list. All right, boys, so our foot chance rewards go to for, I believe, the third or fourth week in a row. Uh, sorry, no, no, uh, gold, yeah, gold two. We managed to hit gold two. Gold three, we packed ourselves Veron last week. Gold two, um, we have, uh, we now have ourselves, okay, another 45,000 coins, uh, two rare mega packs, and a rare gold pack. So, uh, two rare mega packs, which I believe are 55k mega packs, and then one rare gold pack. Uh, gold pack with the two player pick packs. Now, uh, the first thing I wanted to do was check out what players that we have available to us as uh, as informs. So I'm going to hover on over to Foothead right now. And I'm going to look at... Okay, 86 Talvan would be incredible. Again, I'm looking for super subs because I'm not sure any of these guys fit in. It's, it's not a good week for Team of the Week, man. But if we got Lozano or Talvin, come on! Lozano or Talvan! Oh, okay. Oh, Santi Cadorla. I think I called it yesterday. Didn't I call it on stream yesterday? Hey, five-star, five-star Santi Cadorla. I, it, there's no choice. He's 83 rated and we absolutely love him. He's a channel favorite, so we are going to go with Santi. Are you sure you want to select this player? Absolutely. And then is this the one where we get absolutely shat on? Is this the one where every player is under 80 rated? Please! Please! Oh my god! Okay, so 83 and 84. Okay, you know what? I, I'm not gonna... Santimina or Pavlenka, it's gotta be Pavlenka. Alright, so... In terms of reds, for how bad this Team of the Week was, on average, we packed ourselves... We got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. We got the 7th and 8th highest rated player as uh, as player pick selections. 5 star, 5 star, Santi Gadorla. If he had a little bit pace, he would still be an incredible card. Look at the 54 stamina, that's absolutely shocking. And then Pavlenka, who we used as... Um, who we used as our keeper at the start of the year on his way to glory makes an emotional return in the form of a red card. But uh, again, the rewards have been a little underwhelming. We go up to 103,000 coins. The question is, do we get some insane, insane tradable rewards? Let's see what we get. Again, two rare mega packs and one rare gold pack. So, uh, rare gold pack and... Um, oh, sorry, one of the rare gold packs is from the... Uh, one of the rare gold packs, I believe is from the SBC. So let's pop, let's pop open one of the rare gold packs. See if we get anything sweet here. Oh man, is this the first week? I think this would be the first week in three or four weeks where we don't get a walkout. Wow. Uh, Pastore, 82 Javier Pastore. <sighs> man, maybe, I did I really get taken off the red list? Would he really do something like that to me? Uh, Shakiri, we get Zerdan Shakiri, so we're gonna send him to the club. Acosta uh, Villarreal, we'll send that as well. And then just for the heck of it, we'll open this uh, We'll open this other rare gold pack. I think it's from the SBC. It's from one of the UCL SBCs, but we'll pop this one open as well. Can't expect too much from it, I suppose. And we do get a board, though. So let's see what this is. England goalkeeper uh, Pickford. All right, 83. 83 Jordan Pickford. Could do a whole lot worse. And then it comes down to two packs to get our last, uh, our last chance at a walkout. Two packs remaining. We get Fabian Delft. We get Pickford, Vendel, and then... Um, 
whoever the hell that guy was. And then last two packs, boys. Rare Mega Pack. Rare Mega Pack number one. A whopping 30 items. Can I please see that beautiful text and it's there? Please! Please, please, this is tradable, boys. Whatever this is, it is tradable. Argentina! Oh my god! No! <laughs> yes! The red list continues! No way! Tradable Aguero goes for... I think he's 200k! Stop it! Yo, 240,000 coins! Let's go! Yes! Last week, we packed Raphael Varane, who I believe... Okay, let's see. This might be the most expensive guy that we packed. This might be the most expensive guy that we packed on the series. 212,000. Varane goes for 212. Aguero goes for 240,000 coins. And he's 89. That means there's a very good chance we've got maybe an 86 or 85 hiding behind him. No, there's not. But we get Sergio Aguero. Quarter of a million coins. Direct infusion into the squad. So with the, okay, so with Aguero and our 45k for goal two, for finishing goal two in Weekend League, we just got ourselves basically 300,000 coins. Bro, what is life right now? Nah, 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 nah. Whoa, okay. That was our best reward. I That is easily our best reward. And uh, Mandanda. And then 83 Mandanda. Bros, 89 Aguero. If that is not worth, I don't know, like 5,000 likes on the video, I don't know what is. But 89 Aguero, we get 91, 91 Ramos, 90 Lewandowski, uh, not, uh, 86 Varane, and then we follow it up with another, a goal two finish in Weekend League, and we go ahead and we get ourselves the second best Argentine player that you can pack in Ultimate Team, Sergio freaking Aguero. So, okay, we've got some, we got some things to look at on the squad. I mean, what do we do now? This is what the squad's looking like right now, boys. Now, there's a way to get Lala in if I switch Varan to the other side, but then Gila goes on 7 chem. Alaba's fine on 7 on his own, but um, uh, uh, Ben Yedder's been really, really good. 24 games, uh, sorry, 31 games, 24 goals, and 14 assists, and then we get ourselves uh, 26 goals and 21 assists from that 85 rated Werner in the, basically one uh, one less match played. Incredible, incredible striker duo up top. And then uh, Royce is our left winger and then Götze is our right winger. And then Kondogbia and Gila is one of the most beastly CDM partnerships. 6-2 and then 6-2 uh, height combined have strength, just are absolute monsters in the midfield. Uh, and looking forward to taking pretty much this exact same squad. I mean, now that we have... If we sell on that Aguero, if we sell on that Aguero, we would have close to, we'd have close to 400,000 coins. What 400,000 coin player could we sign that would make a huge impact in the squad that you guys see right now? But that is going to be the question of the Epi. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed. The red list luck continues, 89 Aguero. I still can't believe it. I can't believe we actually got Aguero. I thought maybe we were, we were gonna get absolutely nothing and we go ahead and we get arguably a top three, top four striker uh, in the game. But anyway, boys, hopefully you guys have enjoyed. If you did, Hit that like button if you guys are new to the channel. Hit that subscribe button down below. I will see you guys for another upload tomorrow. Till next time, boys. Tschüss. Later. Ade.